Hi guys, Rob here with Deluxe Gaming, and welcome back to my reassembly series, episode 5 of season 3, and the nanovirus race. And look at this, we have a ship that's capable of holding 10,849, that's interesting. So if you look on the left side, we actually, we are carrying more than we can technically hold on the ship. Uh, in terms of R. So how are we going to spend all this R? I'm really, really excited. We actually have some C available to us as well. <laughs> um, we've been... last. If you remember, the last episode, we got attacked by a whole bunch of these little guys. And uh, I don't know exactly where they came from, but I'm sure they're just here to eat all our goodies. Lego my ego! Anyway, so we are going to... First off, well, we're going to be... Uh, oh, I know you guys are waiting to find out who won the draw, but you're going to have to endure one small build. So, really, really quick, and of course, if you want to skip ahead, go ahead. But, I think it's always fun to get the game going with a little bit of a build, and we're going to, of course, speed it up for your viewing pleasure. Okay. Alright guys, I actually really like it. It's almost symmetrical, but at an angle. So it's the weight is, look at the weight. It's, look at the center of gravity. Center of gravity is almost dead center. So this thing should actually fly really, really well. And yes, it's non-symmetrical. If you look at it from a, this is the front and this is the back. But if you look at it as this is the front and this is the back, it's not that far off. Of course, we're missing an engine on one side, and that really bothers me. I suppose I could do that. Um, I, but I like it. I, I think it's uh, I think it's really good. I, I really, really like it. I don't know if it's how well it's going to fly. Now, I decided to go with uh, two miniguns and one MLS anti-missile, which is the fast-firing, fast-tracking gun. So this is designed to take care of those little fighters, right? So that's, that's the goal here. We want to make sure that we can beat up all those little guys. I think we're going to add... One more turning thruster. Now, it's not even in terms of turning thrusters. Well, I guess it is. Like I said, if you look at it from a certain angle, it is even. Mostly. Kind of in a weird way. Yeah, actually, it's not even at all. It's totally non-symmetrical. Whatever. I, you know what? I'm good with that. Now, as far as the name goes, uh, let's... Famous diseases in history. Well, how about a pox? A pox be upon you! <laughs> Save. Let's fly this sucker and see how well he will do. Uh, I, I also want to take a look at his energy. Oh, looks pretty good. Um. <laughs> Come here. Come here. He's not quite as fast as I was hoping. <laughs> fun. Super fun to fly. I'm wondering maybe it needs uh, maybe it needs some bigger engines, but those bigger engines, I don't know. Yikes. We can take the hit. So it's 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 a medium fighter. Actually, does pretty well. well. Of course, we don't want to get. It's funny when you hit some of these guys, they like they like vanish. They just turn to dust instantaneously. Woo! And it, it's a challenge. This is dog fighting, man. This is dog fighting. This is where it gets fun. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna fly back to safety here, or relative safety. We're gonna get sort of out of the line of fire of all the bad guys and we're going to change back to our big ship and we're going to start launching these like they're going out of style <laughs> because they're, it's only worth like uh i don't know like 153 which is peanuts because oh did we oh i think we sold all our oh we did we sold all our art to the station that's okay that is okay because we're gonna go back to the clot i love the clot i love clotting all of my Resources. Whoa, what was with the spinny thing? <laughs> Whoops. I don't know what happened there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, no, no. Wait, who's shooting at me? Aha, I have lasers. I could use an engine. <laughs> There's so many of the little guys. They're eating all of our good stuff. So we are going to launch a crap ton of fighters with all of our juicy resources here. So out of the way. Out of the way. Okay, let's get in here and start collecting. And start launching. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I don't have a factory up yet. <sighs> the fighters, sometimes they, they can stay just out of range like that, eh? Okay, so we gotta... Yeah, there we go. Once they come in close, they're toast. 
because those lasers will chew them up. So I'm trying to turn and get away from these asteroids here. So the goal is now for the next episode and this episode is we're going to start building a fleet. I I'm starting going to start getting serious about winning the game and winning... I mean, there is no end to the game. Technically, there is no end. But winning to me would be being able to conquer pretty much any portion of any galaxy without too much trouble. And if that means we have to build a fleet to do it, you know what? We'll build a fleet to do it. I'm really having trouble trying to maneuver in this mess. Oh yeah, we're just chewing up all those guys. Okay, so let's get our little ship here. Oh, you know what? Actually, before we do that, I, I pre-recorded, so we got home, uh, Lisa and I, we got home and we went into the studio at around, uh, it was about 4.30 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. And we did the recording then because Lisa had to run off to school. So uh, the cutoff was 4.30 Mountain Standard Time. If you missed the cutoff and are still interested in winning a copy of Reassembly, please, please, please go ahead, put a comment on this video and you will be eligible to win the next episode. So I'm going to cut out to that right now. Okay, guys, Lisa and I just got home from work and we're ready to announce the two winners for this round of reassembly and the Steam Key giveaway. Wait for me, I'm coming! Oh god, here she is. I'm here, sorry! <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Okay, are you ready? I am ready! Okay, you started without me. No, I didn't really start without you. I, everybody's waiting and with great anticipation to find out who actually won this round. It's pretty exciting. I have two names. Okay. Okay, you ready for the first one? I'm ready for the first one, Lisa. Okay, Lucas Jakutis. Lucas! Congratulations, Lucas! Round of applause! Woohoo! Woo! Awesome! Well done, buddy! So, uh, yeah, that's he's, great. Congratulations. He's not here to actually reply. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> so he gets a new Steam key? He gets a new game key, actually, for reassembly. Okay. Yes. Sweet. Okay, are you ready for the next I'm one? I'm ready for the next one. Okay, this is my favorite name. Okay. You ready? Yes. Bob Potato. Bob Potato? Bob Potato. That's a... I love Very it. interesting name. Is that your real name, Bob? If so, that's really awesome. I yeah. would love. That's really cool, actually. I like that, Mr. Potato. Mr. Potato. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Mr. Potato. Yeah, thanks, that's Bob. Great. That's <laughs> great. <laughs> Round of applause. Woohoo! That's awesome. Congratulations, guys. I, I, some of the viewers would like to know how you're divining these names. Well, I use magic. Um. <laughs> fairies mostly and small people <laughs> do you capture the fairies or is this well actually I, when, you, I you... when i clean the kitty litter based on what's left in there i can tell what the numbers are so i, I it's, number everybody so it's like tea leaf reading yeah except with cat poop <laughs> <laughs> oh god <laughs> you asked i tell if you're so, not happy with the answer don't ask the no, question no. I, I just want to reassure everybody that this is completely random, but I think that answered that question. Yeah, pretty much. It's totally random. Completely random. It's it's from leading the reading the bottom of the kitty litter. Well, you couldn't you wouldn't let me use scrimping scissors okay. to do the cutting the I'm names rubbing my in eyes in pain. You said no use of scissors to cut the names out anymore because I hurt myself. And then you said I wasn't allowed to touch a computer, so... Have any cats been injured in the making of these, uh... Oh, gosh, no. No, no? I don't I don't hurt my cats. I feed them a very holistic diet of cat food. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Seriously. I believe you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I gotta go. Bye! Okay, bye! Okay. Yikes. Okay, there you have it. Well, what is it? I don't know, but it looks cool. So here's what I was thinking. Well, these scatter guns, I like these scatter guns, but I've been looking for a way to use them that kind of makes sense. But then I thought, why make sense? We've come this far without making any sense at all. So let's, you know, why ruin it now? So anyway, the scatter guns, they kind of, you know, I kind of said before, they kind of look like a little snot launcher. So I'm kind of going with the Booger Bolo. What do you think? The Booger Bolo. <laughs> Oh, terrible, terrible, booger, bolo, and it's only designed to turn left, 
Uh, it'll turn both ways. But if you turn left, you turn faster. <laughs> In honor of non-symmetry, that is what we're doing. Booger Bolo. Yes, I spelt it correctly. Wait, 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 wait. Just for you, those of you that are so worried about the names and my spelling, the K is silent. Hold on. We'll, we'll put it somewhere totally unreasonable. There. The K is silent and the V... Hold on. It's... And it's pronounced Booger Bolo. <laughs> I'm kidding. I won't do that to you guys. Ah, oh, that drives me crazy, too. <laughs> it's a name. I can spell it any way I want. But uh, there we go. Okay. Perfect. I'm, I'm quite happy. Hold on. How do I get back there? Wait. There we go. The Booger Bolo. Let's try that out. I'm super excited. Ooh, that looks like fun. Actually, it's a neat looking ship, too. Uh, it should do some pretty serious damage. Something gets close. Uh, like, a lot of those little bad guys might just get beat up from that. Okay, so let's try it. I, sorry, I wanted to build something while uh, you were listening to Lisa. And I share the winners with everybody. Here we go. And in the meantime, I also built a whole bunch of uh, dudes to just kind of hang out. I'm actually going to sell these guys back. Or release them, I guess. Whatever you want to call it. And we'll get back a little bit of C here. But the goal here is to kind of secure the area now. I'm, I'm getting serious about, you know... Like I said, winning the game because I, uh, I'm i tired of getting my butt kicked. And I think with this particular faction, we're going to need uh, need a lot of help. Okay, so yeah, I turn really fast to the left. <laughs> Hold on, I'm going to change my controls. R. Okay, so I can, when I turn right, it's it happens, but it's it's slow and painful. But I, when I turn left, I tell you, look at that! Woohoo! <laughs> I love it! Now, uh, as far as firing guns, um, okay, nothing happens when I do that. Hold on. We've got to, uh, oh, because I'm in command mode, that's why. Whoops. Minus 30, plus 30. Uh, anybody else? Hold on, let's get rid of these guys. These, oh, it's not paying attention to where I'm clicking. What? Okay. Out of command mode. Into command mode. Sell. Uh, sell. And that'll let those guys go, and they can kind of do their own thing and protect the area, gather resources, and... Oh, look! My station already built another Booger Bolo. Fantastic. Oh, and if in case you didn't notice, I did get pick up the medium-sized shield, which was like 900 uh, C or something. So here we go. This is it. Oh, right. Bindings. Uh, should be left mouse for all these, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Why is that not working? I don't know. I'm still in command mode. Ah, oh, silly me. Oh, I love it. But I, it needs more power. It needs more power, but I love it. The snot launcher. The booger bolo turns left really, really fast. Don't come at it. Don't come at him from the uh, left side because he'll get you. <laughs> he has a weakness. <laughs> and that's called turning right. What, what was that movie? Uh, da, 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 da. Zoolander. Yes. Uh, has trouble turning right. Does not like to turn right. But he does turn left really, really well. Okay, so we're going to add some power to this. He, he draws okay, considering he looks like a schmuck. He, he draws okay. Okay, so let's go to the... Uh, Alright, and we're just going to add a little bit more juice. One second. Okay, I don't like taking out all of this un unobtainium because it does add some really nice structural integrity to this thing. It's going to fall apart. If somebody... Really, the bottom line is if somebody shoots at this thing, it's dead. <laughs> the, oh, you didn't have to take everything off. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we still have a buddy following. Oh, we've got a couple buddies. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. You guys can follow us. That's cool. Okay, so we I added just uh, a couple more of the uh, energy. Ah, uh, it's better. I wonder if we actually change that to ripple fire. That actually might work really well. And uh, this, uh, we're going to put these on auto fire. Those are on point defense. And just the, the snot guns are going to be the ones that, oh yeah, see, look at that. Oh, and actually quite energy efficient if you do that. So this guy, he's kind of a, he's a suicide bomber. Well, sorry, kind of in bad taste. He is a, uh, he doesn't care for his own well-being. You just send him into a place with a lot of bad guys and let him go. And he'll do a whole lot of damage, I'm hoping. So let's see if we can get at some of these little uh, flies. The flies! 
So yeah, and then we're gonna we're gonna stop messing around so much, and we're we're gonna actually try to start building some really efficient ships. Hey, actually, that's, is that an agent? That's not a, it is an agent. Why is there an agent over here? I didn't expect an agent over here. Ah, he's on the map too. Oh 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 oh! He doesn't know what to shoot at. Even I wouldn't know what to shoot at. Okay, you got me. <laughs> Uh, we are surrounded by agents. They seem to be everywhere. And I want to know... Whoa, all of these... Oh, these are friendly... It says these are friendly ships, but they're in yellow. And I think if they're... Oh, right. Friendly shipper station has a factory and will spawn allied ships. Since it is in hostile territory, you will not respawn there. So that's what's happened. Is that it has been taken over by the purple, whatever that is. What... Are, we must be this odd fuchsia pinky kind of weird mauve color... In, in the center here, so I don't know. I guess we gotta change everybody there. Hey, change all the uh, friendly areas to that color. Oh, right, don't turn right, <laughs> turn left. <laughs> oh, what a disaster. <laughs> okay, but I, I just wanted some good point defense ships, and I don't. Uh, so instead, I built this. <laughs> hey, I got a kill. Woohoo! Cause, oh. Good. Right. The unobtainium can grow plants on it. Right. So that'll make it even more difficult to fly. Fantastic. Fantastic. Okay. So let's get back to uh, really building the fleet here. Okay. So we've got the Booger Bolo. Right. Booger Bolos. Okay. That's good. And uh, maybe we will... Okay. No. The Aberrations. Fine. We're going to leave the Aberrations. Influence is fine. Pox, I like the Pox. Pox is a great little fighter. And it's the same cost as the influ Influenza. It actually has the same firepower as well. But I think it's it's organized in a little bit better way. And it's still not symmetrical. So look at the difference. And I, I don't know. I, I like it a lot. Okay, so let's get back into our clot and start building. What are we going to build? More Poxes? Yes. We need a medium heavy ship. But I think we, first things first, let us get some more guns we need bigger guns and i'm really liking the laser so we, we have the arc prp1 there's a station defense lasers uh 230c yeah we'll grab that we'll grab the station defense lasers i don't know if that's what i want station battery so what is that auto firing projectile weapon it does a little bit of splash damage 75 per round range velocity nice velocity so what's the velocity a minigun is 1100 so that's a really nice velocity too uh, lots of energy though. Uh, we're gonna grab that station battery and we're gonna grab the the big laser now It doesn't have the range It's a little bit shorter range than the lasers that we have right now, but it does The one we have right now does 75 per second and this one does 250 per second <laughs> uh, Uses a little bit more energy though 17 per second and this uses six per second so like Three times as much? That's quite a few. Okay, quite a bit. Okay, so we are loading up the Bolo. We're just gonna... Oh, right. And actually, what else can we get here before we leave? So the MLS Avenger, which is like the regular MLS, which is a defensive gun. But this one shoots faster, has a higher rate, uses less energy. <laughs> Absolutely. The RK-12 uh, looks like it's a version of the minigun. Does uh, six rounds... Doesn't even doesn't look as good actually as the minigun. The minigun's better. Uh, just just at a glance. I mean, I might be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. But minigun looks better. And the spitter. This looks like a burst burst fire turret. Okay, now I'm not interested in burst fire turrets. These are just regular projectile weapons. Uh, nice tracking. Hold on. The uh, range energy turret speed 344. It's the same as a minigun. Oh, well, we'll grab that too as well. Why not? We're, you know, let's stock up. Not interested in missiles. We did missiles last time. Oh, heavy turret. Uh, yeah, we can't afford that. Let's upgrade. Oh, we can't, not enough. Okay, so let's just get... We're going to go do some serious farming action. Let our little ship build up here. And we're going to take off the factory. We're going to sell it off. And we're going to get the sea. And now that we've got some security here and our ships... Actually, let's... While we're in... Let's go into command mode. And go to our station by hitting three and tell it it's gonna start building ooh, lots and lots of poxes for sure uh, aberrations are good I like the aberrations they're good to, to spread the seeds and stuff and uh, actually we'll do oh right gotta make sure you make a copy for yourself because you can actually lose your your uh, blueprints by giving them away and we're gonna make sure actually it's gonna build for every one aberration he builds it's gonna build two pox and one 
Booger Bolo. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> awesome. So all of these guys, uh, these Pox guys, will start bringing resources in. And, oh, uh, same with these guys, too. They need to be building... Oh, those are the replicators. You know what? I'm going to get rid of the replicators because uh, it really doesn't do a... S Actually, no, they're, they're good. They, uh, they, uh, they could use an upgrade. I wonder. And so the replicators, it was basically our early kind of mini defense station kind of thing design. I'm just going to do a quick upgrade here, guys. Okay, <laughs> okay, again, kind of impractical. I don't know why I insist on making things that are fragile and weird. But I, I okay, so the goal here is, of course, we want to maintain the spirit of the replicator. The spirit of the replicator was to build a defense station that was relatively cheap. Now, I, it was super cheap before. Before, we, we could build tons of them without any problems whatsoever. Now, we're not going to be able to build them quite so fast. But they'll definitely be a lot more self-sufficient. So we're using the HC3 guns, which is the fast-firing... Yeah, so rate... Oh, 0.6 rounds a second. Okay, so they're not that fast-firing, but they do have fast turret speed, which means they might hit something here and there. And, well, of course, we have the Arcus PRP-3 lasers, which is the... Uh, what do they... They say, need to burn through a battleship without... <laughs> Oh, they got... Hey, they misspell stuff, too! Pick on them for a while. Need to burn through a battleship without breaking a sweat? Try this! And it does uh, lots and lots of damage, 800 range. And these uh, station lasers, which have a little less range, that's why I put them on the outside, but they do pretty good damage for their size. And, uh, yeah, uh, two big energy-producing... Uh, 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 generators in the center <laughs> and uh, of course four medium shields to keep the guts kind of protected and it's it, the design here is simply so that it gets replicated so we want to see lots of those appear in the world right okay so let's uh, I don't know let's maybe we should build one and I, I don't know I think we we've, we've pretty much got this area secured oh man I got stuff growing on me again wait can I destroy that Oh, I must be in command mode. <laughs> That's why. Wait. No. I wasn't. Oh. Oh, all I have on here is the lasers. I have no manual weapons. That's so funny. Everything is auto fire. Okay, that, that's fine. <laughs> Except uh, I've, I've got uh, antlers again. Okay, so we've taken over this area now. Like, for sure we've taken over the area. I feel like we're going to start to make some progress here because we have some ships that can actually, you know, kind of sort of defend the area. Oh, right. Uh, we've got agents that way. <laughs> and we have no way. We have no way to kill agents at this time. Oh, great. And they're on the attack. Fan-freaking-tastic. Okay, so let's... Oh, boy. Uh, mommy. Okay, let's get out of here. Uh, we don't want to change ships in the middle of a fight. I don't know that we can do enough damage to that guy to really stop him from invading. Uh, we're surrounded by really nasty enemies on all sides. We need a place to farm, is what we need. We need to find a really good place to farm. Okay, kill all these guys. Come on. There we go. Yeah! <laughs> fry, fry, snap, fizzle, pop. Awesome. Okay, kind of rebuild a little bit here. 
They do go down pretty quick. Once once I got them targeted, they're they're done. They're finished. Okay, so let's find a place. Maybe we'll let's let's go do some exploring. I think that's that's a good plan. I know we're not in the best ship for it, but uh, the nice thing about this ship is really we're not going to run out of space to put all of our resources. And I'd love to know what the source is for those uh, little flies. Like they must there must be a source. There must be a ship building those. I don't think they're replicating on their own. Though somebody did mention that though they do uh, we never built that ship. Okay. Somebody did mention that if there's even a small piece of them, they will go back together. In other words, will that piece become another whole ship? I don't think so. I think I think that's done. <laughs> I, there must be a ship that's producing them. So we, the key here is... Oh. Okay. All right. There's a blue station. I think we can take him. We've got to change ships here, though. So let's, let's change ships. Let's go to the Scissorax, which is sort of our main combat dude. And actually, let's see what this guy's building. Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't expect to be attacked right away. Ah. Uh, I always do that! And then they come and they take all the stuff, and then they go build more ships, and then I feel like an idiot. Okay, well... <laughs> damn it, and I have like 3,000 points there. Okay. <sighs> Sometimes I wonder. Okay, so this ship... All right, we're on the... Let's change our controls. Cursor. Okay, so we're going to stand cursor for now. Right, because we've got the schmutz launchers. Uh, I think we can take them? I don't know. I think... It... Oh, right. Oh, yeah, we can take him because he's got missiles. Missiles are his primary weapon, and we have ways of destroying missiles. Oh, whoa, 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 except we can't get too close because when we get too close, the lasers start to fire at the ship instead of defending the ship. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's rebuild a little bit, guys. Let's get those. Yeah, so stay just out of range the lasers. We don't want the lasers targeting the ship. And, ah, the schmutz launchers just don't go long enough. Or they don't have enough range. There is another gun that's a step up from the schmutz launcher, and I, I actually like the look of it. I think it looks really cool, so I think we're going to try and upgrade to it, but of course uh, that's going to be tricky. Ah, oh, man, we we need a ship with range. I don't think we, we got rid of the ship with the longbows. Oh, no, we still have the... Ah, right, we still have this one. Okay, so we're going to have to... Ah, okay, let's just get rid of... I'll, some of this. I don't know that this thing's got enough firepower even with the longbows. Let's go sell this before we get any closer. We need we need some serious firepower and I, which means I have to build a strictly combat ship and we're almost ready to do that. I just want a little bit more sea before we do it. We'll, we're almost there. We're so close. Uh, I mean what actually see hold on uh, let's go to upgrade. So we uh, see we can yeah, I, I want about a, I want about 4,000 points to build with. So let's see how much damage these longbows do at range and how many shots it would take. Okay, first off, bindings. Uh, the only thing I want on the left mouse button is the longbows. So everything else can go. Lasers can go auto fire. These can go auto fire. These can go right mouse. Perfect. So yeah, we do have schmutz on here too. I like the sound of them. I don't know if you guys can hear them. I like the sound of him. Okay, I don't know if we can do enough damage. Oh, we're still shooting something else. Okay, let's take that on, put that on auto fire. Perfect. There we go. So we actually get blown back a little bit when we use these. It's pretty funny. And I don't think we can do enough damage to actually punch through that shield. If we could, even just for a second, I would know we could do this. Oh, oh. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! So we we took. A, oh, he's got. I'm in range of those missiles, but that's okay. Oh, they're drones. They're not missiles at all. Oh crap! Hold on. Uh, one. Hold on. No, B. We need to change this to point defense. These are the the lasers. Yeah, PRP ones. Yeah, they should be attacking those. They're drones. They're not missiles at all. Okay. Here we go again, trying to escape, and we'll be completely unable to escape. Uh, whoops. <laughs> I hit all the buttons at once. It didn't help. <laughs> ah! We just need a little bit more firepower, and we can take down that dude. So we're, we're just going to, we're just going to go, uh, we're just going to do this. It's a terrible idea. 
Oh, we can't. Are you kidding? Oh, son of a... Okay, no, we can, we can adapt it on. You know what? We're going to throw an adapter on here and we're going to make that happen. There we go. It's terrible. Absolutely terrible. But this is called a field refit. Okay, here we go, guys. Building the gun. <laughs> We've got better guns. It's just I want to see if we can take this thing down. Oh, Jesus. Where'd the agents come from? Are they following me? Oh, how did that happen? Oh, man. You know, you know what's funny? I think our best ship right now is the cargo ship. <laughs> I think I think it's the, the one that makes the most sense. Why are the agents down here now? I think they are actually following me. This is uh, this is not good. Okay, so let's see what this, this guy's building. He's building... Hold on, nope. Uh, let's go to command mode and go three. What are you building? Okay, certainly you can build some ships here. Let's uh, throw some some of those. So all the aberrations. Yeah, all the all the good stuff. Yeah. Uh, where's the other one? The new one that we just built. Where is it? Scissor axe. Replicator. Replicator. Yeah. Build build a couple of those too. Right. Perfect. <laughs> there's a there's a rhino virus. He's caught a rhino virus. Aww. <laughs> okay. Uh, our gun is done. Let's go test it out. Or is it done? It's not firing. Oh, because I'm in command mode, that's why. Okay, here we go. Oh, 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 almost got that agent. Almost got that agent. Come on, get him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, they can't fight the station. Oh, uh, yeah, the one thing that I haven't built in this game is that station right there. Makes sense, right? You know, the simple fact that these are player-made ships and I can't kill them simply speaks to the fact that my ships are not very efficient. Uh, we're doing okay, I guess. Uh, this thing does not turn well. We took off all of its... Uh... <sighs> la dee da uh, Okay, turn. There we go. Good, good, good. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, no. Turn a little bit more. Yeah. Oh, if we can get targeted on them, these longbows are pretty good. But, uh, oh, yeah. Oh, we ran out of energy there. Fortunately, the drones and the missiles, uh, those lasers are just excellent at killing both of them. See, I love the tactics because they get you distracted with one of them and then they come at you from another angle. It's actually brilliant. Let's see if we can take this guy out at range. Nice. Yeah, you gotta hit him. Gotta hit him, dude. Gotta hit him. <laughs> okay. They really... Oh, they're taking down the station! No! 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 Don't! No! No, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! No, no! They got... They got the station. The agents are overrunning our faction! This... This is war. This is war. They've actually destroyed one of my outposts. Okay, guys, we, we have to retreat. Look at the map. You know, this is the first time in my experiences with reassembly I have lost ground. Look at this. So this agent, I think he's the red... This is the deep red color here. He's actually captured. He's, he's traveled along this path, capturing everything along the way. And we've actually lost ground. Okay, so we, we need to regroup. And I think we're going to call that an episode... We're not winning the war. Sorry, we lost the battle, but we will win the war. We have not yet killed a primary agent. We've killed agents. We've held, killed enemy player ships, but we have not killed a primary agent. And uh, I think it's time that we start to get serious. So I hope you've enjoyed the episode. The series is about to get brutal because I'm, I'm, I'm upset now and uh, it's time to make some... Uh, pretty serious decisions about the ship designs. <laughs> okay, guys, I hope you're enjoying the series. Take care.